welcome to Australian Survivor. The adventure of a lifetime. Over eight heart-stopping seasons. Go champions! Go contenders! Australian Survivor has put its players to the ultimate test. Brains right on Braun's tail. The heroes, villains, neck and neck. But last season, go. Get him, get him, get him, get him. delivered the most exciting, explosive game so far. Glory or death. Players <laughs> defied the odds. A hidden immunity idol. It was most certainly not an idol. Served the biggest blindsides. Fraser. Checkmate. Whoa! And betrayals. Shawnee. Oh, boo. Which ultimately left one villain standing. Liz. Yeah! You are Australia's sole survivor. Yeah! And now, we're back in the home of Australian Survivor, Samoa. A remote paradise where breathtaking beauty is lashed by unforgiving elements. Here, 24 brand new players will take to the battleground. Two opposing forces divided by their way of life. Pitting those at the top of their game against those who play their own game. This is Australian Survivor, Titans versus Rebels. is someone that has achieved a great feat against all odds. Titans are forced to be reckoned with. A tribe of leaders. The term just a girl is something I've heard my entire life. In my culture, being a girl means you cook, you clean, you wash dishes. But I can deadlift 190 kilos. Girl, I am a queen. Queen Bee, address me as such. <laughs> the Titans, they are the bosses, experts, overachievers, and masters of their craft. A lot of people don't like lawyers until a lawyer saves their ass. I've worked at some of the biggest firms and the best firms across the world. From Turkey, Switzerland, the UK, Saudi Arabia. One of the cases that I worked on was worth in excess of $7 billion. So Titans will dominate, will crush our opponents. And despite my socks and sandals. Titans are ambitious. From CEOs and social media kings to supermodels. But if you smile for no reason in Russia, you assume you're only an idiot or you're just a crazy person. Being a model, sometimes I play dumb. They are thinking this dumb bimbo, definitely not gonna, you know, not gonna go for long. 
We're expecting for me, because coming from Russia, the sleeping bear is inside of me, ready to fight. They're used to taking control, making the rules, and calling the shots. I think people may look at me and see a normal dude, a 35-year-old from Townsville. What they won't see coming is the fact that I've got over a decade of experience influencing other people. As a diplomat, I've been a trade negotiator, a crisis responder. In Bangkok, I was the guy who led Australia's effort to get Hakim Al Rabi out of jail. Please stop them. Influence is an art. I'm happy to be the maestro of the tribe. I just don't want them to know that I'm the one waving the wand. But whenever someone makes the rules, there is always someone else ready to break them. Rebels. They are the Mavericks. Thrill seekers. Outsiders. And underdogs. Being a band of misfits, the Rebels, we do it our way. I think we've got what it takes to absolutely annihilate the Titans. In my profession, daily I deal with thieves, deceit, and shoplifters. I'm a loss prevention officer. I walk around the shopping centres undercover, catching thieves. I am on high alert 10 hours a day. Going up against the Titans, nah, is nothing to me. I've caught doctors and aeronautical engineers. I'll be on them like a bloodhound. These rebels are used to taking risks, pushing boundaries, and creating anarchy. I am a bar manager. I do get judged on my personal appearance. They just, <laughs> they run the other direction. I'm like, please come back, I'm not gonna hurt you. <laughs> Much. Rebels are the renegades the ones who rage against the system, and they get in the heads of their opponents. As a psychologist, I've been analyzing people for more than half my life. So coming into Survivor is like a psychologist playground. In my job, I can honestly say that I get along with nearly everyone. And then they get to know me and they're like, holy shit! They call me the no bullshit psychologist. I just am an extreme extrovert who likes to do fun things. And if people tell me not to, well, it means I've got to do it. These Titans, they ain't seen nothing yet. They haven't seen me coming, and when they see me coming, I'll be a force to be reckoned with. And I feel sorry for these young chicks, to be honest. And the young blokes. They walk on the wild side and turn the obvious into the unexpected. I can be mistaken for being this dumb, big Arab from Western Sydney. Uh, that's the complete opposite. I'm a genius. I work in human resources, but I'm the person that manipulates emotions. And I know how to pull on heartstrings as well. Last time on Survivor, George was the closest thing we had to an Arab being on TV, and we loved it. He's like my homeboy from Western Sydney, but I need to take it home. I need to bring it home for all of us. That sounds so cocky, but I'm here to finish what he couldn't do. Whether they are a titan... I'm a titan of sports management. I've got some 18-year-olds, half a million dollar deals. There's been no one that could really compare to me. Or a rebel. Unorthodoxity, if that is a word, is a second language to me. People that are interesting stand out. The freaks of the worlds. They will all need to play to their strengths. 
and create their legacy as the next Survivor greats. But only one will outwit, outplay, and outlast the others to take home the half million dollars. 47 days, 24 people, one Survivor. You always dance like that. Hands on <laughs> hips, looking out all serious. You look disappointed. It's good. <laughs> the man. Come on in. You ready to rumble? Hi, Jonathan. How are you? Hey, Jonathan. Hello, there, mate? Oh. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So <laughs> excited. Oh. oh, my God. <laughs> Welcome to Australian Survivor Titans versus Rebels. <laughs> You are 24 new faces, and you're about to begin a game like no other. Now, you've been divided into two tribes based on your approach to life. <laughs> and we're going to see which approach is best suited to the game of Survivor. On the blue tribe, we have the Titans. You know what it's like in life to be the best. <laughs> You're the head honchos, the big cheeses, the experts in your field. Keep going. <laughs> you like calling the shots, making the decisions, and ending up on top. But out here, there is a tribe that is determined to get in your way. The Rebels. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it's like to forge your own path in life. Yes, you know where the line is, but you don't mind crossing it. <laughs> Woman in the front with a pink shirt. What's your name? Kelly. Kelly. <laughs> so, rebels generally like to break the rules. Absolutely, she is. <laughs> I was born a rebel, <laughs> and I'm gonna die one. <laughs> Great. So why is it that you like to break rules? Because it's fun. Life's just about having fun. So just have a friggin' party. We're only here once. <laughs> <laughs> Amen, sister. Amen. <laughs> Gentleman with the blonde hair. No, you're, you're in here. Hey, uh, Raymond. Raymond. So do you feel like you're at home on this tribe? Um, they actually told me at first that yeah, we need you on the Titans tribe. And I was like, um, no. They said, they said, how rebellious, we might as well stick you here. <laughs> Great answer, I love it. All right, let's talk to the Titans. Woman in the front here with a light blue shirt. What's your name? I am Viola. Viola. So Viola, what does being a Titan mean to you? Being a Titan is someone that doesn't give up. Someone that persists no matter what, no matter how rebellious the other side is, we always do everything we can to win. That's us. That's Titans. Gentleman in the back with a floppy hat. What's your name? Jaden. Jaden. Well, you certainly have the size of a Titan. <laughs> Do you feel like you're on the right tribe? Yeah. It's not about the size. It's about the size of your heart. <laughs> oh, you like that one, Tom? You like that one? <laughs> nice. I like it. All right. OK. Well, it doesn't matter if you're a Titan or a Rebel. You all need to play hard, push the boundaries, and make your mark, because at the end of the day, only one of you will walk out of here with the title of Soul Survivor and the half million dollars that goes with it. Now, before we get started... Buffs. Go ahead, put them on. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Mom. Thank you. Really cute. 
And on that note, are you ready to get to your first reward? Yeah. Yeah. All right, the goal is simple. You just need to light up the flag at the top of your totem. Here's how it's going to work. On my go, you're going to race out to a pontoon loaded with fire-making material. You'll then bring that material back to shore. Once you think you have enough, you'll then build your fire under the totem. First tribe to burn through their flag wins reward. Want to know what you're playing for? Yes! Winning tribe will take back to camp the most valuable item in this game. Fire in the form of flame. <laughs> so right out of the gate, you can boil your water, cook your food, stay warm. Not only will you have a huge advantage at the start of this game, but you'll be sending a message to the other tribe that you mean business. All right, I'll give you a minute to strategize. We're going to get it on. Human conveyor belt. Yep, yep. Hang on. One more. Rebels are bringing stuff back one at a time. <laughs> Watch your queen. Keep it dry. Careful. Let's see which one pays off. Yeah, take that, take that. I think we need another person runner on the beach. Tobias with a huge armful of logs. Wow, you are a machine. <laughs> Rebels like to do their own thing, but they are working like a well-oiled machine today. But over at the Titans, not so much. Quick, 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 quick. It is confusion and chaos. You got to run up. I think we need to carry it. Do what they're doing. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Stop down, down, down. Wow, just like that, the Titans have given up Keep on their conveyor belt. Maybe there's too many captains and not enough soldiers over there. It is hard work making your way through that water. Hey, what are you reckon? Dropping me up enough. Who's gonna pull the trigger first? That's the question. I reckon that could be enough there. That's enough, Timbo. Let's go. Yeah, we'll think they've collected enough wood. This way now! Call it! This way! Move on! Let's get him in! Cannot I'm stop out. building a fire until everyone is back. Come on! Come in, Ray! Come, hurry! Yes, here we go. Right, let's go. It's the rebels back first. Yep, 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 yep. Come on. Get out there. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, let's, let's go. go. Rebels start working on their fire. Bro, you want kindling under Put it on the ground first. Put it on the ground. While the rest of the tribe are building the fire, someone needs to light the torch. It's Eileen on the flint for the rebels. I need someone ready here, guys. Titans are back now. I did that. It's going to be the best for making fire. Nathan on the flint for the Titans. Nathan has a spark, but can he get it to catch? A couple of big ones. While the rest of the tribe starts building their structure yeah. under the totem. Let's get this base good. Yeah, hold on to it. You guys just stack yeah. onto it, yeah? I reckon it's more hot. Make it taller. 
Eileen. Blunt side, blunt side, blunt side. Scraping the magnesium, taking her time. We need to get fire. Right, stand them up, stand them up. It's not going to go in if it's not standing up. You want to build a fire big enough and strong enough like to burn your totem. No, 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 no. Don't you get it, it needs an airflow. <laughs> Someone get that fire going out there, please. Eileen struggling on the flint, having trouble getting something going for the rebels. Are you gonna swap out? Gonna swap out? Swap out? Yeah. We'll strike it, strike it. It's Rihanna stepping in for the rebels on the flint now. He's coming, he's coming. You can see it, you can see it coming. Wow. coming. Okay. Just like that, Nathan has flame and he has the torch lit. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. coming. Watch out, watch out. Five, five, five seconds. Five, five, five. And then just gotta go for it. We don't want fire yet. But you can't build it up. No, I'm good. They're lighting up their structure very early. It's too hard to build up now. It's a risk. <sighs> Why did we light that up so early? Because if they can't build it up high enough and it goes out, they're going to have to stop work and go back out and collect some more. More husk, more husk. So here's the test. Have you built a structure that's going to burn your totem? Yeah. Tobias now trying to get flame for the rebels. The rebels have a good structure, but that'll count for nothing if they can't get flame. Come on, get that fire going. Relax, relax. You got it, you got it, you got it. You got it, you got it. Let's bring the torch, bring the torch. Light the torch, light the torch, light the torch. Finally. The Rebels have their torch lit. They're going for it now. Here's the test. Will it stay up long enough, and will that fire be strong enough to burn your totem? Panic starting to set in for the Titans. Give us some oxygen. Careful, careful, careful. Some more kindling. We need to do more kindling. Watch out, watch out, watch out. It's coming. It's smothering, guys. Get that one back up. <laughs> Titans got their fire lit first. <laughs> the rebels seem to be pulling ahead. They took their time arranging their wood, and it could pay off. believe it. It's almost surreal. First challenge of the day, seeing Jonathan. Like, I'm a bit fangirl. Like, whew, okay, is this happening? Beans and rice and Like, the buzz and, and, and just energy. Nice work, bro. It's amazing. 
Alright guys, I'll start. Um, my name is Alex. Uh, it's nice to meet you all officially and um, I'm a teacher from Perth, so oh, yeah, yeah, that's fair. Hey. Rebel teacher at that. <laughs> uh, I'm Rihanna, but go by Riri. Um, I'm a paramedic from Adelaide. Yeah. Hi guys, I'm Sarah. I'm from Newcastle and I'm a firefighter. Wow! <laughs> I'm Scott, I'm from Tassie. I'm an extremely creative soul, and I'm an art director at Mona. <laughs> Being on a tribe surrounded by other rebels is absolutely awesome. But no one knows I'm a psychologist on this tribe, and that never will. My name's Kelly, I'm from Cairns, the best yeah. place ever. Woo! I got two awesome kids, and I support people with mental health and things like that, yeah. and lots of other things. Yeah. I'm very good at analysis and reading people. I really think I'm going to be potentially under quite a lot of threat if they know I'm a psychologist. So I've got to keep that on the lowdown. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Get started. Crack on fire. Yeah. I think you're the most suited at uh, leading a bunch of. I'm feeling great about this tribe so far. You know, we've got the first win on the board. As a team, we're working, which is really, really good. Right, we're starting with fire. Yep. Right, wood. Let's go. Yeah. We're going good. There you go. Being a teacher is going to help me with Survivor. Oh, legend, that's what we want. Being able to see different characters at school uh, and then be able to adapt my behaviour to keep them on site is literally what this game is all about. We've got that set up now, Kelly. I reckon what we'll do is we go and get the shelter, try and get the shelter a bit more sorted. Oh, shit, shit, shit! I think it's too much. I know, guys. Good. Needs oxygen. <laughs> Come on. Hey, it's simply going, Kel. No, babes, uh, it's not. It's just, just catching you up. You don't reckon? Uh, it's it's, hey, it's it. going. It's going. Are you sure, babe? Yeah, it's going. We're good. That's it. Kelly's happy now. Guys, everyone. Kelly is uh, a very loud sort of person. <laughs> We got the fire going. We're just gelling as a unit. Not like those Titans. Running around like headless chickens. So the challenge today, absolutely I'm on the right track. We're just a bunch of rebels. Everyone's hunky-dory, everyone's happy days. This is absolutely mind blowing. Like, I'm literally playing Survivor. This is insane. So looking around at the rest of our Titan team, it's pretty incredible. We've got some absolute man mountains. Uh, my name's Jaden. Compete in strongman. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So we lift cars and just throw that out there and lift cars. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm not the most physical player out there. <laughs> I'm under no illusion that these guns aren't firing. And then we've got some people that I can only assume are incredibly smart. I'm Jess. I am a nutritional scientist. I work as a senior lecturer at a university. I'm Kitty. I own two businesses. One is a coaching business, and then I have a skincare and supplement company. The, the concept of a titan really opens the door to all sorts of experts in their field. I'm Caroline. I'm a midwife. I have delivered thousands of babies, so, oh, wow. yeah. 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 Uh, my name is Winner. Profession, I'm not sure right now. I'm supposed to be an engineer, but now... <laughs> But now I'm like a TikToker sort of thing. Hey. Yeah, it's like I started from like competitive eating because I'm a competitive eater as well, so I'm like ranked in Australia. Wow. Yeah, what? I'm ranked wow. like eighth in Australia for eating, so. <laughs> Just eating in the wrong place. <laughs> um, hi guys, Eden. I'm an area manager for a cinema chain. Um, so I've been looking after about 11 different sites across Victoria. I'm a Titan because I have one of the vastest understandings of pop culture of anyone I know, possibly anyone in the world. 
probably a Yoda level, like Jedi Master level. I've seen every film, I've seen every TV show. I can quote things verbatim. Working in a cinema for 20 years, every single person out there has a favourite movie. Like, like, it doesn't matter who you are. Everyone's seen a movie, everyone's got something. And for someone that knows nearly every movie under the sun, that's going to allow me something to just instantly connect with people about. I want to, I want to like bust out some uh, movie references with you. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, I can quote Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park. Oh, really? My wife loves that movie. Oh, she has the most favorite movie. She's got a T-shirt. It's like a Jurassic Park. Yeah, same. <laughs> 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 Black with the red on the front. <laughs> Jurassic Park. 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 Jurassic um, well, obviously, I see a lot of movies. Yes. <laughs> yeah, what? Yeah. Um, do a lot of like trivia nights and stuff oh, like that. Oh, love it. Um, love a good trivia. Oh, I, reckon, yeah. I can see you as a trivia fan. Yeah, yeah, I bet yeah. you would say like a really funny teammate. Yeah, yeah, don't, don't, I think as Titans, we've got the natural upper hand in this game. You got it? This one? Yeah. Wow. And I'm sure we'll have no trouble getting a roof above our heads. <laughs> Mate, editing manual way, we're all good with the shit. I'm so bad. So that's me. I don't do it. Yeah. If I have to sweat at work, no way. <laughs> nah. Yeah. Um, all right. I feel like <laughs> someone needs to go over there and be like, guys. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> you know what this reminds me of? You know the cheese? Think oh, of that. Baby, 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 baby oh. string. That's what I feel like right now. That's childhood, man. Bro, they got to come with hand weaving and weaving. Uh, weaving eh? <laughs> a bunch of leaders getting together to do anything doesn't work. Um, so we've got a lot of ideas about the shelter. Do we have a shelter? <laughs> There's a lot of resources and they're currently on the floor. Where's Bell? Walk about. Yeah, yeah. Huh? The hot Russian. Oh. <laughs> Oh, no. Come on. We're going to be sleeping in the rain. In my real life, I would literally delegate to everyone. You do this, you do this, you get me this, can you get me a coffee? I'm a 33-year-old Bondi girl who runs my own salon. I'm actually used to being underestimated. When you're a hairdresser, people automatically stereotype you. She can't be intelligent. She doesn't know what she's doing. She's a female. At the end of the day, I've built up a beautiful salon from nothing. I've been a Titan for my entire life. Like, if I want something, I've almost never not gotten it. And that is because I will work my butt off to get what I want. First impressions in the Titans, we've got some big boys. I did two weeks of trade school once. It wasn't for me. And some fit girls, me being one of them. They say don't judge a book by its cover, but we've all seen this movie. The weak kids get killed first. All right, let's do this. Wait, wait, hold. Where's, where's this other hole coming? Forget that we have to do more than survive. Yeah. You can really fill the group oh, up. 100%. Story. It's hyphens. It is like, it's funny now, like, we're all like buddy buddy, like, we're all <laughs> It's gonna start. Like, we're gonna kill oh, each other at one point. Oh, 100%. <laughs> I really vibe with Nate. Because I feel like he will do as I say. Let's cut some of this stuff down, we're running out of light. I'm gonna need to learn to, like, move him as a little puppet. Let's chop some shit. What about this one? Who are you vibing with so far? Um, so when I look at group dynamics, um, we need to have a plan in motion to take over. But it's really hard day one because you don't want to come out hot. What about the Russian killer? Bad. I've got a very good You don't like position. it, Muppet. I've got a really good She's good on the eyes, though. People. But, no, yeah. OK, I think we keep the muscle for now. Yeah, 100%. How do you feel about grabbing some of the other weak people. Hey. Hey, look at that. That's exactly what I'm thinking. Eden, because I like him, and he's funny. 
and he was Have like, you remember everyone's name? Don't know. <laughs> Eden, um, the big nerdy guy. Yeah. Keep ca ca keep Caro. Mate, we can carry Caro the whole way through, and she's not going to be a threat at all. She would have spoke with us. Who's Caro? Who, oh, the poor baby. <laughs> Mum. Caroline. I want to schmooze her a little bit. She um. loves it. Oh. In my real life, I always am a take charge person. And in this game, I'm here to win, and I will take anyone down in my way. That's how you do it, mate. Thank you. Oh, what's that board by saying, Joel? Yeah, yeah, I forgot to mention that. Like, I condemned the 190 kilos. I should have oh, said that. Shit. Oh, shit. I'm a professional, like, pal. I was a professional. <laughs> <laughs> like, just forgot to mention it. Nah, Mark, he's gonna say <laughs> He's doing my head in. Yeah, I'm down with that. Waking up on this island is absolutely gorgeous. The sunrise, the water. That is magnificent. Lovely. We have a great shelter. Chris, woo. We have fire. However, my first night in camp was absolutely horrible. Worst night ever. Probably got around 30 minutes of sleep. I thought I was gonna struggle the most with food on the island. That is not the case. I take that back. Please slap me in my face if I ever say that again, because it's not. It is the sleeping arrangements, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, who's cuddling? Well, well, I didn't. You didn't come to bed. Well, I asked you lots of times. Well, I'm gonna have to slip in there at some point. It had Tobias and Sarah having their little sandwich. It was also uh, Alex and Peter having a sandwich. A very naughty sandwich, <laughs> may I add. <laughs> it was uh, very, very comfortable for a first day sandwich. You know, the, the first sandwich is always quite an innocent sandwich. This sandwich wasn't very innocent. This sandwich had all the toppings. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing really well, considering no, we, we had hardly any sleep. <laughs> but for us to go into the next challenge with our bellies full, massive boost to the team. We're already going to be one step ahead of them. Yeah. Yeah. They've probably That's had awesome. no food as well. Yeah. So I'm definitely happier to be in the Rebels tribe than the Titans tribe. It's just up from here. <laughs> Day two, it hasn't stopped pissing down rain. I do feel like a wet chicken. Uh, they destroyed my super cute look for today. Yeah, well, okay. It is what it is. It is what it is. It's a survival table. We can reach it. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> That shelter, which I kind of even call a shelter. Okay. The whole thing. Oh, yeah. There we go. No, the, the whole thing collapsed. The whole thing collapsed. I'm swimming home. Yeah, <laughs> chopping me out of here. And sleeping on these bamboos, I just feel like I age 70 years in advance. How do you sleep? Thinking it's like a, a dog shelter or something. 
absolute trash here. I would say there are too many leaders in one tribe trying to work together. It's a complete disaster. Larry, you, okay? you do what you did. Do what you did. Okay, do that. Do that. <laughs> but out of everyone that I met at this tribe, I have found the love of my life <laughs> on this journey, which is Viola. Uh, um, no matter what, I like you. <laughs> Blood on blood. Skin on skin. <laughs> like, the moment you said that you were fighting a wolf, I was like, that's my girl. That's my girl. Where else are we going to find a Russian that fights wolves? I'm not. You're sticking with me to life. So that's what's part. In this game, like, you need that type of person yes. with you. She is the person that I can trust. Who's good vibes, who's bad vibes? What's her name? The CrossFit R. Little Miss Big Booty. Ah, uh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Frank. Yeah, I like Frankie. I love her. Good vibe. And I like Mark. Yeah. I'm vibing with the same Mark quite a bit. But it's still early days. Me and all are having a very strong bond. And I know I'm going to stick to my girl. And I will go with her until the very end. Yeah, so yeah. you had to work it. Yeah, I was there oh, for like yeah, yeah. three years. Yeah. No way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was yeah. awesome. I, I love Thai. Do you speak Thai? Yeah. Yeah, we can speak Thai. Can you speak Thai? No way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can speak Thai. We can speak Thai. We can speak Thai. Get in from lap now. From lap. crazy. Yeah. I thought day two would be easy peasy lemon squeezy, but it is absolutely not. This is stress depressed lemon zest. I feel like a little bit of a fish out of water. I don't think I've seen you topless now, and I'm liking, I'm liking what's going on there. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? From the type perspective, like, it's a work of art. The yeah. whole thing is a work of art. Or being. Mm. I'm an academic. I'm one of the best university lecturers in all of Australia. But I don't know whether I have any strong connections. That is not the attitude I want going into an immunity challenge. I reckon we'll be up and about of the challenge. Like, yeah. I reckon we'll be up and about, because, I don't know. I'm excited to too. If we don't know. Yeah. I think there's a couple of strong girls. That probably have the same skill set. Someone like Frankie. Yeah. Jess is really? in trouble, man. Jess actually pulled me over. She's like, she's like, oh, where's your head at? Like, she's like, I think we've got too much strong women. So like, yeah. that's it. I'm like, your head's on the shoulder. She is throwing yeah. me under the bus. Yeah, that's, yeah, 100%. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, I'll watch Throw my I'll name under and I will go over you. Day two, and I'm already having my name thrown out. And it's because there's too many strong women in the tribe. Say so we go to trouble tonight, yeah. we're voting Jess. Yeah. yeah. Mate, come at me. Let the game begin. Oh, shit. This is how I go, Frankie. <laughs> Right. 
So, Kelly, rebels walk into camp with flame. Did you put it to good use and make a nice fire? Absolutely. Many hours spent <laughs> blowing that little flame to make it an enormous flame. We had a few people doing the old dragon breath to keep it alive. <laughs> Okay, so Jess, how did the uh, Titans do without fire? Oh, well, we had each other to hug and keep warm. So I think uh, by the, this morning, we're actually a lot closer than we were previously. The fire's right here, Jonathan, right here. It's in the heart. It's in the heart and it's in the soul, and that's all that matters. A bit cold, though. <gasps> all right, are you ready to get to your first immunity challenge? Yeah. Yeah. Let's yeah. go. All right, for today's challenge, you're going to work together to raise a heavy crate, releasing a giant wrecking ball. You'll then transport that ball over a wall, across a conveyor belt, and up into a high tower. Finally, you'll roll it down the other side to smash a series of targets. First try to smash all their targets wins immunity. And this is the immunity eye. Yeah. This is what you want in this game. With this back at camp, you are safe. Without it, you're gonna be seeing me at Tribal Council where one of you will become the first person voted out of Titans versus Rebels. Trust me, no one wants to be that person. <laughs> All right, I'll give you a minute to strategize. We're gonna get to it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 
Finally, the Titans have caught up thanks to Jaden. Go, 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 come on. Rihanna, first to the top of the tower for the Rebels. OK, let's go. One at a time. Go, 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 go. Nathan, first to the top for the Titans. And last but third. They might regret that decision when they start lifting. Straight down the middle. Straight down the middle? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Paul! Paul! That wall is heavy. Over 120 kilograms right there. It's going to take all of you. That's why we need the strength there. Giving it everything. Whoa. One, two, three, Paul! 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 Quick work of it. One, two, three, boom! Yeah! Three, Rebels have it at the top. Nicole, Nicole. OK, hang on, guys. Kelly taking charge for the Rebels. OK, so let's get accuracy. Accuracy, don't, don't panic. Got to yeah. One, two, boom! One, two, boom! Titans trying to catch up. One, two, boom! All right, wait, we've got time, we've got time. Rebels trying to position the ball. Go right down the middle. You ready? Yep, you ready, you ready. Set. Rebels have a crack. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. And they connect the first target. Rebels lead one zip. Come on, girls. Oh. Come on, girls. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, Titans still one, struggling two, to get their ball to the top. One, two, three. One, two, three. Great energy from the Rebels. Nice work, guys. They're reloading. Get the caravan at the top. Spin around. One. Titans are yet to get the ball to the top. Rebels are going again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Great effort and communication from the Rebels. This is whipping up that track. One, two, three, four. Wow. One, two, three. Titans are in trouble on this one. Finally, they get it to the top. We need some more of those guys. Bro, we need the glass, bro. Turn it up. We've Push done it. a stupid ass. Oh, we can't swap. Nah. Get ready, guys. We're going to have to go again. Because we're all girls. Yeah, we need them to come ready. down. Bro, we need the guys. Jaden in the back! Get the big Simone at the back. Push it over! Push it over! Rebels taking their time. Now, it's got to be as close as we can. Making sure they have it in the right position. Yeah, aim, aim. Let's get this guy. Go. 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 And they get one. We are tied. 1-1. One, one. The Rebels finally are going to have another crack at it. Go. Here they go. Yes. Connect. Yes. The Rebels lead 2-1. They're really picking this out. Well on the again today. Titans almost at the top now. Okay, okay, same again. Same again. Mark, you unclip, you unclip, you unclip, you unclip. Much better. Finally, the Titans have worked out that hoist. Question is, can they catch up? Oh, yeah. Titans having a crack now. Will they connect? Yes, we're tied 2-2. Two, two. Now we have a challenge. Rebels have it in position again. OK, good shot, girls. Good shot. No. Guys, we're going to turn it the other way. We're going to turn it the other way. That's it. We're going to turn it. They're going for the win. And they miss. Yes. Yes. Right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That opens the door for the Titans. Come on, Titans. Pick it up. This is your opportunity. Can they get that ball up fast enough? Train and go to back. Train and go to back. Let's train. Go, train. Let's train. But their rope is twisted. They need to readjust. Right, I'm flipping, I'm flipping. I'm flipping, I'm flipping, I'm flipping. Confusion over at the Titans. For sake. They had an opportunity, but they've squandered it again. Go, go, go. They're just arguing over there. Keep it going, keep it going. Wasting precious time. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Rebels going up again. Two more. One, two, three, four. And they seize this opportunity. They can smell victory. Get it right this time. Get it happening now. Right on. Twist it, twist it, twist it. Take your time. Take your time, Windsor. Now, hang on. It's not accurate enough. It's not enough. Oh, one more turn. One, two, four. One, two, four. Rebels have it in position again. They're going for the win. Come on. Hit it, baby. Hit it. That's it. That's it. Ready? Go. Well,
Rebels, well done. Immunity is yours. Who wants it? Rebels, you are safe. Nobody going home. Head on out. Enjoy your night off. All right, Titans, Tribal Council tonight, where one of you will become the first person voted out of this game. Head on out. I'll see you tonight. I'm actually pretty excited about Tribal Council. This is where the game really begins to be played. Jess is lovely, but I just feel like she's a bit of a... Not irrelevant, but just a little bit of a... Like, she's... I think she's an easy kill. Me and Frankie are becoming a little bit of a formidable duo. I think together... We're just ready to crack in and take control. Yeah, it's exciting. It's a shame we uh, didn't win that one, though. You guys will have a quick team chat about no, how we all went. Uh, yeah. Okay, we've lost one, we lost two. So we're doing something wrong. It doesn't happen, because it's not happening for the rebels, and it's each time it's costing us time or organisation. Right? Um, We've, yeah, we've been losing my little bit, yeah. which is so annoying. Yeah. I'm like, I'd rather lose my little one. <laughs> yeah. yeah, just like, look, we're still finding our footing. We all gave it a good go. You're yeah, playing catch up from the start, though. There was a lot of instruction today. Oh, yeah. mm. And a lot yeah. not followed. Yeah. Look, we can, yeah. we can stand here and we can talk about everything we did wrong in the game. Yeah. Or like, you know, yeah. next time. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, Everyone's sure. heart was in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. 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 I'm grabbing water. Yeah. She just shot herself in the foot, didn't she? Like, that was so perfectly timed. It's funny. She saw her next challenge. Like, you're not going to beat you. <laughs> I know Jess lectures people for a living, but you know what? I'm, I'm my own... I'm the boss in my life, so I, I don't really like being lectured. I reckon, I reckon it's an easy one. Because I reckon everyone's on the same way. Down for Jess, I'm, I'm down for Jess. She's like in this cafe. Alright, let's do it. Go, go, go. The smallest thing is gonna set you apart from the tribe right now. Because it's still early days. She gave us all a lecture. She just put a big target on the ground. Yeah, yeah I was thinking the same. Yeah, yeah. yes. So Nathan and I want to do a real easy vote day one. I suggest them. Yeah. No, just who's that? <laughs> Go on. Out of everyone that's tried she to get to know people as well, she, she, she hasn't tried to know one. She, she did. And now she's forcing it. Because <laughs> <laughs> even yesterday, her socialising just wasn't all there. But yeah. Enjoy your flight home. Yes, sweet. <laughs> I think we're working with everyone tonight. Do you know what, girls? Watch. And if you guys just stick with us, just stick, just stay solid, and we'll carry, like, we'll carry you through. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look, it's first vote. So first vote, people still don't want to ruffle any feathers. So tonight is all about keeping the peace, kumbaya, whatever. We just need something that's going to make us feel united as a tribe. But something for you, she actually said, um, there's too many strong girls on this team. The audacity. was like... But... Yeah, so I she threw out, she said the strong girls, so that was like... That's you, me. you, me. I feel like this bit's going to be so easy, we'll actually all sleep better today. Perfect. <laughs> there's not going to be any like, oh my gosh, what is this mean? No, no, it's clear. We chuck the bad seed out. Bad juju, be far away. Yeah. Easy. Go that. Easy. I'm down, down go. Let's do it. Yeah. We're, we're talking to Chas as well. Build 
of sort of like pseudo alliance now, like sort of like Jaden, uh, Frankie, me, yeah. Chaz, yeah, Carol, yeah, Caroline, yeah, yeah, Carol. yourself, and and whoever. Like we'll probably see after tonight who just stay stay solid, stick with Jaden and myself, Frankie, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. great too. Nathan seems like he's used to being sort of the big dog in any situation. And she has a good spot in the, in the shower bra, so I'm going to take that down. <laughs> he's gravitated immediately towards the strength dynamic. Nathan, Frankie and Jay. You know a rinse or no? Are you having a swim? No. Nah. Are you having a swim? Oh, yeah, come in. We'll come in. My little survivor radar is going up at the moment. Strong people tend to look at the weak people and go, like, I'll get rid of them. They're pulling us down. She doesn't give much in the way of challenges. Like, she's not... Like, she's, she's not... I won't the, miss her. She's, she's nothing. Yeah. And we just go bang, bang, bang. <laughs> she's good. I think he's forgotten that there's actually a lot more other people that don't consider themselves super strong on this tribe and we're all different types of titans. That could actually <laughs> outvote them if it comes to that. I think mean, this Nathan came to me and he's like, oh, this is, yeah, so we'll, we'll form a new group. It'll yeah. Be, like, it'll, be, it'll be me, yeah. Yeah. me, Jaden. He, he lists them first. Yeah. I'm like, it. and he was listing people, and yeah. he puts me yeah. last. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and he's yeah. like, I'll yeah. drag you girls because along. Yeah. It's like, yeah. oh. We want to set the tone for the game. We don't want the narrative of the game being, oh, strength, yeah, let's tighten strong, yeah, blah, 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 because that doesn't play into my strengths. My strengths are mental. And I'm pretty sure that Mark would agree something needs to happen. Hey, Where do you want to go? I'm not sure. Um, what do you think? Yeah, someone. Hey, guys. Yeah. Hi. Hey. What are you guys thinking? I'm open. Like, yeah. Really open. Um, what about you? Like, I reckon. Well, that doesn't sell me. Um, <laughs> I'm. At this point, if it's like we all like each other, if mm. it's a hard one to. Yeah. You can see already, like, you know, little alliances and yeah. vibes start to form. And yeah. It's very obvious. Uh, yeah. 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 Um, there's like a tight, there's a tight three. There's a tight three. Yeah. Nah, yeah. that's. And a tight brawny three. Yeah. yeah. I hear you. Oh. Yeah. 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 So, would you want to go one of those strange maps? I haven't heard you laugh since the challenge. Oh, no, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm totally picking up yeah. what you're putting down. Yeah. I know it's very, very early to do this kind of blind side, but you only get to play Survivor once. This game is live. This game is happening right now. We're not taking easy street. But yeah, I'm definitely like open to work. Yeah. Right? Yeah. We play hard. Mm. Yeah. We make moves. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like. Yeah. So would you want to go one of those strange maps? I want to just have a few more chats, but I'm totally picking up yeah. what you're putting down. Yeah. yeah. Like, I really want to, like, keep this going. I just, like, want to, like, just see the lay of the land a little bit. Yeah, but, yeah. yeah, I'm definitely, like, open to work. Yeah. Right. For me, as a former diplomat, yeah. <clears throat> this is where I can shine. I see Tribal Council as a nice little test run of my abilities to play the game. Like, it's just... Hey, Hey, Charles. Hey. How are you feeling, mate? Hey, yeah, good. Yeah. Let's, yeah, let's make room for Carolyn. Just coming in here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 cool. It's okay. Um, what do you think? What do you think? 
Yeah. 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 Open to thinking, like, what's this mother's call? And that's yeah, what yeah, we—that's yeah, what I'm here yeah, for, because yeah. we need to hash this out. Yeah. Do you yeah. guys have any thoughts? I can dress as a pretty. Yeah. Fine. I haven't really had really that much, much of a connection there. No. With the no. Uh, it's yeah, a good point. Would you be open to something else? Maybe. Yeah. Um, but again, it'd be pretty compelling. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Because they're making a pretty strong case. Yeah. 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 Nathan. Frankie and Jaden have gone for a swim. That suggests to me that they are extremely comfortable within themselves and they're not really concerned about their perceptions with respect to the tribe. So look at them. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is a perfect time to send someone else home in a blind side. I think of the combo yeah. trio. It's, it's getting a little bit cosy, a little yeah. bit tight. That's what I think. Yeah. Yeah. And they'll taste yeah. take over. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And we don't yeah. want that. No. Yeah. no. We're, we're not letting that happen. Okay. If we peel Frankie off mm. and keep Nathan, it's not a thrift to us. Yeah. 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 Frankie. Oh, Frankie. Frankie. Yeah. Yeah. I see Frankie as a massive threat. <laughs> She's strong physically, and I think that she has a lot of influence in the tribe and could convince people like Valeria and Viola to vote with them. Guys, like, yeah. I see, I see, like, you guys are fine, but like, you know, me, Eden, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. the beast, beast yeah. vendetta. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's seven. Yeah. Is that seven? That's seven. Yeah, it is seven. seven. Yeah. That's seven. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. You guys will speak to the rest. Yeah. I'll talk to the MDs. But I think they're on board. The next really important duo is Viola and Valeria. Hey. Come and join me. I've seen them chatting to Frankie. So it makes me a little bit nervous. Please. Should we say the name? So we're all clear. Yeah. Frankie. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you're going for free, for sure. So... Oh. Yeah. Okay. You know, it's still early days, so whilst I do feel like I've got a good plan in place, tonight's a big call, it will be a test. Who can I work with moving forward? Yeah. Mm. Saying, um, everyone was just. Yeah, I want to move for Jess too. Oh, we should be done. Okay. Mm -hmm. Just. Oh, because God, that's, that makes things so much easier. I, know. I thought I'd have to explain all this stuff so, to you. Oh, I was like, I you're on it. Yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> when, I, when I speak to you. Um, oh, wait, no smiling. <laughs> no smiling. <laughs> when I, uh... I'm feeling pretty confident the boat's on Jess and that everyone feels the same way. But. I'd be lying if I wasn't a little bit nervous. At this point, I feel like I can trust... Do you know what? At this point, no. I don't feel like I can trust anyone. I don't know anyone. <laughs> How you guys going? Go on. Yeah, I think we're all on the same page. Right. We just have that... We're just yeah. having that nerve of... If, if something... Uh, yeah. I am comes up. She hasn't chatted to me, and she said she wants to get rid of one of the strong girls. Yeah. But only a girl. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh. I think she's very paranoid, but, um... She's very easy to read. I think we'll, we'll know. Yeah. 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 So just gonna have to just keep an eye on feel comfortable about this. Yeah. Yeah, right. yeah. I've got things going on, so you've got to keep them in your loop, not in your right back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can just adjust, Danny. 
If you're, if you're happy, just go chess. I'm nervous about it. Oh, I'm not. I'm, you're like right or die for me. You're not going to die yet. Trust is a hard fought and easily lost. I have created some excellent bonds with some of my tribe mates. So I am hopeful that uh, those bonds will stick and our plan will be uh, executed with perfection. Yeah, everyone's yeah. so locked yeah. in this Everyone's good. Hell yeah. There's a really unanimous decision feeling tonight and Jess is frigging easy vote. So tonight is all about keeping the peace, kumbaya, whatever, until I'm on top. Each of you has a torch. Go ahead and grab one. Come forward, dip it in, and get fire. This is part of the ritual of tribal council because in this game, fire represents your life. Once it's gone, so are you. All right, so Nathan, you're 48 hours in. You are still sleeping on the dirt. You're losing challenges. Is this how you imagined the game would start? It's definitely not how I imagined it would start. Um, as a wise man once said, it's not about how you start, it's how you finish. So we're, um, we're still in pretty good spirits. We're not complaining Frankie, let me get this straight. You're two days in. You've got no shelter, you've got no fire, <laughs> you haven't won a challenge, you're about to send someone home. When you put it like that, it yeah, sounds when, bad. When it's in a big list, it, it doesn't <laughs> sound great. These are just the cold, hard facts, Viola, okay? These are facts, but our feelings matter too. We're still smiling. <laughs> the yeah, accomplishments exactly. are to come. Is this tribe of Titans a titanic mess? Look, yeah, it's disheartening. I don't like losing. Um, I think a lot of us here probably aren't used to it. Um, I think we worked really hard to get where we are. And so we just have to find out what we're doing wrong and fix it. Because that's what we do do in our lives. So, Caroline, what's your take on this? What do you think's going on with the team? I think that we all get along super, super well, but we're actually not playing smartly. I think we need to think about what our strengths are and how to put our best foot forward. But are you fundamentally saying there's no one leader in this tribe? Is that what you're saying? There is no one leader in this tribe at the moment, no. So, Frankie, how do you become a leader in a tribe of leaders? <laughs> I don't know if we necessarily need a leader but we do need some leadership. Well, Nathan, you seem like a pretty confident chap. Do you, have you felt the pull to become the leader for the tribe? Somewhat. I think uh, we've got some like, highly impressive people here. Yeah, some pretty different characters, different strengths and different um, weaknesses. But. Yeah, I mean, like, there's some people that are standing out, for sure, that are sort of taking a bit of a lead, whether it's in challenges or where the vote's going tonight or, or whatnot. But um, I think tonight's where the action's going to start. You're going to see 
who the leaders are and where the boat's going. The relationships that have been formed and um, I think they're just going to become stronger. So Jess, often the early vote comes down to one of two things. It's about maintaining strength in the tribe so that you win future challenges and you don't come back here. Or there's a personality issue. Well, how do you see it tonight? I think it's a, it's a mixture of both. We want to keep the tribe strong, and there are certainly people here that have great physical attributes and can do amazing things. But there are some people that maybe have the same attributes as others. So looking at whether we just focus on the physical or the intellectual, it needs to be a, a bit of a mix. So, so Mark, what is tonight's vote about it? Is it, is it about maintaining your relationships or keeping the tribe strong for challenges? Uh, I'm not sure that I necessarily see a dichotomy. Um, I think we can have our cake and eat it too, as they say. Let's start playing. Hmm? Let's start playing. Relationships are really fundamental. Uh, you know, without relationships, you do have nothing. And we have an extremely strong tribe. I just see this as being about trust, building trust. So, Viola, how confident are you in your friendships tonight? Um, I think I've built some very strong friendships, and I mean that genuinely because I think friendships are the first and foremost thing that start before you think about building alliances. I think I'm very confident in the trust that I've built, and I'm very confident that I've picked the right people to rely upon. Well, Mark, let me ask you, how confident are you in your plan tonight? Jonathan, you'd be a fool to, uh, to uh, think that you know how this game works. Can't be too overconfident. Um, you know, we all are titans but uh, I don't think anyone here is foolish to think that they, um, they know how everything's going to play out. Frankie, are you confident in the relationships you've established at this point? Yeah, I'm confident. I think, um, I, look, I feel confident coming into this one because this feels like a, it will be what it will be, first tribal. This is first time. But I think the game's about to start. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs>
go count the votes. First vote, Frankie. Jess, one vote Frankie, one vote Jess. Jess, one vote Frankie, two votes Jess. 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 That's four votes, Jess. One vote, Frankie. Frankie. That's four votes, Jess. Two votes, Frankie. 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 We're tied. Four votes, Frankie. Four votes, Jess. Frankie. That's five votes, Frankie. Four votes, Jess. Frankie, that's six votes, Frankie. Four votes, Jess. First person voted out of Titans versus Rebels, Frankie. That's seven votes, that's enough. Need to bring me a torch. Frankie, the tribe has spoken. Good luck, guys. Enjoy. See you, Frankie. Thank you. Thank you. See Say you, Frankie. Frankie. Well, this tribe walked in with a lot of confidence, but I'm sure you're walking out with a lot of questions. Good thing about coming to the first tribal. <laughs> All right, grab your torches, head back to camp. Good night. Thanks, Jonathan. This season on Australian Survivor. Gaby boys. Survivors ready? Go! Let's go! A David versus Goliath battle is brewing. Whoa! Whoa! Not today, Rebel. Not today. Come on, Rebel! And when powerhouse players go head to head in the toughest challenges, <laughs> an explosive rivalry begins. Who want to know whether you're single? I am single. Can the Rebels raise hell? <laughs> Perfect rebel behavior. That's what we're born to do. Or will the Titans strong arm the competition? We've got some big, big boys on our side. We are forced to be reckoned with. Honestly, I don't know what happened. I got a bit blindsided there. I would be lying if I didn't say I was disappointed. I always knew going in that I would appear as a big personality, a big threat. Frankie, playing too hard to say. 
I guess at the end of the day, um, I may have rubbed some people the wrong way. I do think they made a mistake. I guess in the end, Jess just got away, but we'll see how long that lasts for her.